I don't get how some people will put up with anything just for love. I love watching you play. Pianists are so cute. The top of your head is cute. You're cute, you know that? You're so cute, I think I'm gonna give you a big hug and a kiss on the nose. That's real concentration. I try to be the sort of person I think you probably like, but you don't react. You don't do anything. You don't say anything. I talk to you, and you don't even answer. Sometimes I get the feeling that you don't even know I exist. Beethoven? What? You're going to hang around here. You've got to like Beethoven. All right, but I'll just have a small glass. <laughs> you blew it, kid. He's not very friendly, is he? You could say that. What do you think would happen if I turned around and gave him a big kiss? Who knows? How should I do it? Just whirl around and kiss him? Why not? <laughs> Blah! You musicians are something else. Sending out a bunch of valentines, huh? Uh... I suppose there's a cute one in there for me. Why should there be? I don't like you, Charlie Brown. I've never, ever gotten a Valentine's Day card. Couldn't you just send me one out of pity? No, I won't. I said I won't, so I won't. You really keep your word, don't you? That's very admirable. Thank you, Charlie Brown. You blockhead! Charlie Brown, I've been feeling awfully guilty about not giving you a valentine this year. I'd like for you to have this one. Hold on there! What do you think you're doing? Who do you think you are? Where are you when everyone else is giving out valentines? You don't care anything about Charlie Brown. You just hate to feel guilty. And now you have the nerve to come around and offer him a used valentine just to ease your conscience. Well, let me tell you something. Charlie Brown doesn't need your valentine. Don't interfere. I'll take it. No, he's right. You take it, Schroeder. With all that anger inside, you're the one that needs a little love. <laughs> Get married someday. <laughs> <laughs> well, why not? Give me some reasons. 
I don't like you. You're crabby all the time. And you're too bossy. Those are reasons. I wouldn't marry you unless you were the last girl on Earth. Did you say if or unless? I admit I said unless. I hit a home run. A home run? You never hit the ball out of the infield in your life. If I hit a home run, will you give me a kiss? If you hit a home run, I'll give you the biggest kiss you ever had. Incentive! Come on, Lucy. You can do it. If you hit a home run, maybe we'll all give you a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> She did it! She hit a home run! It's kissing time! La -da 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 Okay, Schroeder, this is it. You promised to kiss her. A promise is a promise. That's the only way I'll ever get you to kiss me. Forget it. Another triumph for women's rights. 